The warm weather is on the way to the Contro Valley, and if you were looking for spring-like temps, well, this is going to be the week to see them and able to do some nice activities going into the weekend. And a warm forecast ahead for us with temperatures in the 70s and 80s. That's pretty much going to top off the weather story going into this week with dry weather developing throughout the week as well. But February, we reached the end of it. We're heading into March, and we didn't do too bad overall. We saw 13 days below average for this time of year, and then we saw 15 days above average. So we had a little cold snap going into last week. But notice we have been more warmer than we have been cooler going into the most of February. Now things are going to start to transition a little warmer. It's cooler across Texas right now, seeing some 40s in portions of eastern Texas, some 50s as well, 46 in Marple, 45 in Amaretto, 56 in Laredo, a little variety of temperatures going forward across to tonight. And we've got some cloud cover over much of our region, too, across the Lone Star State, extending from Dallas all the way into the Panhandle and into our region as well. A little clearer down there near the tip of Texas where they may be seeing some clear skies for us. However, those clouds are keeping us quite warmer right now. That's why we're, most of us are in the 50s here across the Lone Star State and across Texas and the Contra Valley. Seeing 41, some more clearing down here where we're seeing some temperatures dropping down into the 40s. Overall, that's why we, they're able to be a little cooler. Now, last night, we got down into the 20s again and then hopped into those 60s as we got into the 11 o'clock hour and stayed that way. Got a high of 69 degrees today and expect that warming trend to continue with cloud cover staying into the forecast, mainly into conditions tonight. We're not going to see those clouds disappear for most of us, not even into your morning when you start your work commute. We'll be in the 40s with more 40s coming forward until we get a little higher in temperatures into the lower 70s. That's expected. Thanks to that guy here right there, high pressure. And then we're going to see this low pressure system develop here over the Rockies. This is going to come down from the southern Rockies here, give us a little more wind. The conditions come into Saturday into Sunday. Then after we go through Sunday, we'll get a little more gusty ahead of our next weaker front, which is right now not expected to bring us any moisture, but could bring us a chance for some windy days going into the weekend, but also mean some beautiful weather and into tomorrow. So if you had those packages that you've been waiting for, shouldn't get any delays tomorrow because we're going to see temperatures pretty much warm, start out cooler in the morning. And depending on when your package arrives, definitely in the afternoon, looking like some A-OK -okay conditions going forward into the rest of tonight. But the rest of the week, it looks pretty good with temperatures being pretty much warm throughout much of the week. We're seeing plenty of sunshine, maybe a little bit of cloud cover for some of us sticking that way through the weekend. Weekend looks nice, A-OK -okay to go out and do things with the family. With temperatures being in the six, uh, 80s, excuse me, going into Sunday and possibly into Monday. And then Monday, we kind of cool down after that cold front comes through. Again, some of us could see an isolated shower, but right now, definitely not too confident with that, with models disagreeing on where the, uh, most of the moisture will be. Tonight, though, we'll get down around 40 degrees with mostly cloudy conditions. Warming up into the low 70s tomorrow with plenty of cloud cover to start. Winds out of the southwest at 5 miles per hour your next five days into your bus school bus forecast. We'll see pretty much cloudy skies into the start of dropping your kids off. And then when you go pick them up, it'll be in the 70s. And then the next days to come looks beautiful as well with plenty of nice weather overall with warming temperatures in the 70s and 80s and looking nice into the week.